Privyet comrades, this is Jet Desert Fox, and this is my debrief of Milsim West Road to Rostov. First, I want to talk about the videos themselves. Now, I tried a very different format from the Jump to Crimea series, which, looking back, I feel I should have just stuck with that format. I thought I had explained enough of the effects and other immersive aspects of Milsim West games in that series, but it was evident in the comments. I did not. The use of blank fire guns confused viewers the most. To clear the confusion, here's how blank fire guns work at Milson West Games. Players themselves choose to bring blank fire guns. Each and every blank fire gun is inspected and documented by Milson West staff for safety purposes. Blank fire guns do not shoot any kind of projectile. They are solely there to add immersion to the battle. That being said, Players being fired at by blank fire guns have the option to call hit or not. However, players with blank fire guns struck by BBs have to call hit. This has sparked some debate whether blank fire gun players should be immune from BB hits because their presence adds to the immersion and, since calling hit from blank fire guns is optional, they pose almost no threat to enemies. What do you comrades think? Should blank fire gun players have the option to call BB hits since it is optional to call blank fire shots directed toward you? The game itself was one, if not the best airsoft game I've ever been to. This was largely because of the group of friends I was with and the fact that we were stomping NATO into the ground. The intensity of each firefight and the scale and environment of the AO really made it feel like we were in Russia. The night mission and Sunday's final battle were the most intense airsoft battles I've ever been in. The use of flares, lights, lasers, and other special effects during the night mission is something you don't normally see outside of the military. Sunday's final battle was the most epic airsoft battle I've ever witnessed. The constant haze of smoke grenades, the screams from wounded players, and the roar of gunfire was something I've never experienced in airsoft before. To all you players on the path for that next level of Milsim, Milsim West is your destination. Hey, 20. Game.